What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the Union Campaign. This is part six. Okay, so we got the is the Eastern Army against the Confederate sharpshooters. Eighty percent accuracy. Damn. Let's fight. So I'll see you on the campaign map, battle map. Welcome back to the battle map. Now I'm assuming, big assumption here. That's these skirmishers. These uh, sharpshooters are like skirmishers, so I'm gonna run into them with my cavalry. Good, good, good. Okay, so I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let my volunteer infantry be a meat shield for my boys. I think veterans do have some cavalry. What good is Hampton's Legion? Are the sharpshooters in the back? Okay, the sooner I can get my, uh... Everyone into position, the better. <sighs> so we got... Johnson! Ooh, famous southern commander here. Okay, I really need my cavalry to take out these sharpshooters. 80% accuracy, they can easily shoot out my men. So I'm gonna have these guys fix their bayonets. And charge into the cavalry. So they're going after my cab as my cab's charging these sharpshooters. These guys don't even get a shot off. I want my sharpshooters to go in there, militia. Come on. Okay, as we continue to feed troops, it looks like the Confederates. I think we're going to engage the Confederates here. Guys, turn in on these guys. Hampton's Legion's being hit from the back with the Volunteer Infantry. They have sharpshooters are right in the middle. That is going to hurt. Okay, so these guys will just route. Be extremely happy. Looks like with those guys spraying into the backs of the Confederates. We do have the height advantage here. What are these guys doing? Very well at getting shot. Come on, waver it. Route, route, route. These Union, these Union cabs did a lot better than I thought. Shatter Hampton's Legion. Okay, good. Now we're going after Johnson, their commander. I need to go after these sharpshooters. Yeah, I hate the sharpshooters. I wish we could have some of those, but... I know the Union has sharpshooters. I know, we're, looks like we're picking out the state militia here. Sniping them. Hampton's Legion is gone. Our primary target were the um, sharpshooters, which we have got in the melee. So, you know, they they don't seem to have bayonets. So yeah, they are skirmish type units. So 
looks like we're just going down the line, messing them up. Clean the volunteer infantry. Very brave man. Yeah, me just bonsaiing down the middle with my uh, cavalry. Looks like it's working. So I'm gonna run up my center here. Continue to kill these guys. Yeah, you know, with the uh, seeing your fellow state militiamen run is probably not good for your morale. Seeing them run away, so that's definitely hurting the morale. These guys on the left side, they're giving my guys a hard time. Oh, the veteran infantry finally shattered. If we win the battle, they'll come back. Okay, I'm gonna withdraw. My cap's taking way too heavy casualties, especially with all my men shooting into there. So we're gonna run away just as two units open fire on these guys. We're gonna run towards the back of these guys. Try another charge. Just as these guys rout. Okay, two cavalry strikes. Well, one on that unit, one on this unit. I mean, the war is just not going well. I mean, it, this was considered. I thought they wouldn't have a lot in West Texas, you know, but this army that came out here shattered that. All we got is Johnson left. And Johnson was killed. Yep, there goes Johnson. Joseph E. Johnson. A lot of these commanders got killed that were famous for the South. I haven't seen Early yet or Hood. Anyway, let's end the battle. Yep. Morsby was a, com a Confederate com um, general. Interesting. Okay, I'll see you back in the campaign map with the results. Okay. As you can see, L600 men, they lost their full force. No, Spain. Not trading America away. At the ready. Said our path was blocked. Ah, this sucks. Doesn't help that we don't have any roads. Can't do it, sir. Forward for crown and country. I'm gonna do that. Repair this building. Make ready. Oh, I need all these troops. Your humble servant. I thank you, McClellan. Virtue I don't like you very much. Valor unconquered. Onward. Them. Don't know canning. Weird. Make ready. McClellan doesn't have any stars. Major general during the Civil War, and he. Do you guys know that he ran against Lincoln in the 1864 election? How stupid is that? Okay, this army is going to attack the Confederates at the farm, including regular line infantry. There's Hood and Longstreet. Hey, I haven't seen those guys yet. Okay, West Texas is ours. These guys are unhappy. And they're making me a lot of money. So I'm going to leave that on. Right now we need to repair the buildings. And with this, I can actually make a lot of troops. Including some cav. Which is good. So let's see, the Confederates only have two territories or three territories left. The goal right now is to get rid of their little armies that are raiding all over my provinces. So, I said this guy's on. He's on search and destroy missions. Wow, they're getting all these armies. Sir. Troops forward. Okay, so this army is going to be heading towards these guys. So I'm just going to attack that. 
Louisiana, chill. We're gonna use some militia. I won't let you fall into the hands of the enemy. These are just cranky, so I'm just gonna give them some volunteer infantry. Cool. Let's build the state house out, help keep the populace happy. What do we have here? Rebels taking over the British provinces. That's not good. What are my objectives anyway? Okay, blah blah blah. Chronicles. Those are my missions. Are you kidding me? You want me to attack Quebec? Okay, so I have to take Quebec also. Nice, realistic expectations. Okay. Gotta launch an attack against a bunch of Indians. Alright, guys. Medicine Men, my favorite, as you've seen. If you've seen my Spanish campaign, you'll know I love Medicine Men. Especially when they kill all my troops. Okay, let's get General Mead. Some Lightning Brigade. Get some Irish. Pennsylvania. And some artillery, and we'll send that army up. Now, can this guy... No, two turns. I hate the wilderness. No Spain. No France. Good Louisiana. I'm happy you're riding. Thanks for breaking stuff that we have to pay for. Make ready. Your humble servant. Yes, sir. Okay, I don't know what to do. We do have a large army. It's probably worth turning back. These guys are tough too. Sir. Oh, I hate this area. I hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. We can improve the railroads, we might be able to uh workers are rioting. I know East Texas is gonna have a revolt. Strength and honor It's actually pretty obvious. These guys are gonna go attack them. Killing these little Confederate armies. Oh yeah, good. They marched right next to me. Went a bunch of dummies. Fight me, you cowards! Hey, look, a rebellion. Better rebels have given them a bunch of Hampton's Legion than good troops. That's fine. You'll be happy soon enough. Virginia, Yorktown has been here for a while. Let's build a naval port. Shipyard. We can build some ships. Pennsylvania's building up the army to go take out Quebec. Anyway. Sound the call to battle. Tell me we can just kill this guy, please. Victory. Good. That army is crushed. This army can start army. marching out. So we got some confederates, two generals. What the hell? Am I out of money or I ran out of militia. At the ready. Can I only have a max of a certain amount? Crush them! Strength and honor! It's totally it sir. Considering I have two armies there, I'm gonna backtrack a little bit and make sure that army's defeated. Or at the ready. I don't know. Victory! All I know is that I'm gonna disband a lot of my militia, especially up in Virginia. There we go. Don't need these guys either. I honestly don't need this artillery up here. Cool. They're still unhappy. Do we really need all these guys up here? Yeah, these guys are all happy. Okay. Now you can make some... No, you can't. Why can't you make some troops? Oh, you idiots broke the building that makes the troops. That makes sense. 
Okay, we'll end another turn. Okay, you know what? The diplomacy, they should fix this. You shouldn't just be able to talk to Spain or France. Oh! It's becoming winter! Can't do that, General. Come back here, you coward. Stop wasting my time. Sir. Make ready. Make ready. These guys want to attack. I dare them. Yes, sir. Gotta fight them in small groups. Proud and victorious. Ha! True. Another small Confederate army killed. If any of them come over this river, we'll be ready for them. So we're just gonna wait here for the Confederates to attack. We can go around Texas. I don't really care what they do. Everyone else is pretty much happy, so. I was looking good. Let's end another turn. I did just lose track of my time though, which is not good. Sir. Go until it's the enemy. Men. Wait. Where the Confederates go? Are they right here? At the ready. Oh, you're right there. Is rather annoying. Okay, I did just lose tack track on my time, so I might have to end this a little early. Just gonna give them a bunch of elite units, and then I'm gonna give them one uh, black unit. Okay, moving up. Foraging no, they're gonna offer me nine thousand dollars. Nope. Spain, you don't need more turf. Make ready. What do we have Forward. here? March. General marched out with a lot of his troops. Ready for orders. Make ready for battle. At the ready. Strength and honor. Just killed the Confederates here. Got two armies Forward. heading on Mississippi. These guys are oddly enough running away, which is kind of pissing me off. You do have some stuff to slow them down. But they can just honestly run around my lines. If they get close to Virginia, I'm just going to send the force from Pennsylvania that's waiting to go up to Canada. And that army's getting close to Missouri. We had this all worked out. And then the Confederates took over and started training troops there. Yes, sir. Triumph! Fight me! Got a bunch of engineers and cannons. They got engineers, they got Irish Brigade, they don't have any sharpshooters. And they got good cavalry. Good news, he didn't move. It honestly might be faster just to take a boat. Well, yeah, I could. Yeah, we'll do that. Where'd that port go in Virginia? Dockyards don't do anything, so you can't even... They haven't added ships yet. Wow. Okay, well, there's no point in upgrading that, because they haven't added ships. I understand. I mean, it's going to take a lot of programming to change all the ships to be ironclads and wooden and stuff. I understand that. That's not their fault. Okay. Officially held it under siege. Abraham Lincoln the third. What? <laughs> I don't think there's an Abraham Lincoln the third. Great Britain has declared war on me. What the hell? Okay, guys. Yep. That's exactly why I auto save there. Okay, hold on. I'm a little confused right now. Why did Great Britain declare war on me? Like, do we have past grievances or something? Undaunted. Ha! There we go. Undefeated. Okay. 
St. Louis is under siege. Hold on. So this whole border here, I got an idea, England. You're like three provinces. How about you take back Montreal? Oh, this is such a pain. Such a pain. I'm gonna have to go through. So these guys are gonna take that. What do the English even have? Colonial line infantry. What do we have? A bunch of militia? Okay, we can take that little army. Nice. All their little armies are now coming from Texas. Hold these guys under siege. These guys will just be here. We'll keep them there, try to provoke it. So Miss Missouri's here. I'm gonna attack these guys. And I'm not sure what time it is, so I'm just gonna end the part here. And then I'll see you in the next part to fight this battle. It's going 2 2 1, Sonic. I hope you enjoyed.